Hi everyone. So now we learned that how we can change Android app icon in React Native. So let me show you which icons I am talking about. So these are some applications which is uh, pre-installed in our uh, Android emulator. For example, Chrome, Clock, Calendar, Settings, YouTube, uh, YT Music, and all. They all have the different different icons. But whenever we are installing or creating our first application, they have a default icon. They don't have the different icon. For example. Uh, here you can see that first project and project ts the both have the same and default icon so now let's say we want to change these icon then how we can do that uh, that we learn in this video and these are the points and one more thing guys in this video we will change only android app icon i will create different video for ios app, uh, app icons all right so firstly we have to generate some icons uh, you can generate these icons by the online tools or photoshop however you want right that's totally up to you but here i will use uh, some online tools so that we can just uh, create icons quickly right because our focus is to change icons not creating icons after that we will uh, replace our old icons to the newly generated icon and then we have to make the uh, our application build all right so let's just open a new tab in chrome and just simply put their android app icon generator and you will find some options there uh, I will recommend their easy app icons because uh, there is some uh, good options uh, that can just help you out to just uh, make your icon perfect. For example, firstly you can choose your file uh, so that you can just generate the icon according to that image. So here you can see that. So there is some image like how uh, much padding you want to provide to your application and there will be three icons legacy, round and uh, full blade. Right. So let's say you will provide more padding, then icons will be smaller. If you will just remove this padding, the icon will be a bit larger. After that, you can change the background color. You can change the name. Even if you will just uh, slow it down, it, here you will just show. It will show that how your application will be look like. So if there will be more padding, then icon will be a bit smaller. If there is a uh, less padding, then icon will uh, will be much bigger and it it will be look better right so we will go with the minimum padding and let me just download this image so whenever you will download it will give two options ios plus adaptive icons ios plus uh, legacy icon only but only but we need the adaptive uh, icons adaptive means with this legacy icon they will uh, give the rounded as well as full bleed icons also all right uh, and we don't need these iOS icon, but still there is an option to so just download them. But we will only use Android icons for a moment. So whenever you will download, it will just provide in a zip file. So let me just open it in the download folder and let me extract this also. So let me just extract with the same folder. And whenever you will just go inside, you will find two options. We will go only with the Android and inside the Android, we have the different, different app icons because uh, some mobiles have the, uh, 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 you can say that high resolution qualities, some have the low resolution qualities. So these are the according to the mobile screen size and the screen resolution. So we need all of these. So once you will open that, you will find that there is an IC launcher and a IC launcher with the foreground and rounded and in every format right so what thing you have to do now you have to just go to the place where you have to just put these icons so just go to the android app src main res and here you will find all of these folder better to be just open uh, this folder in the file explorer and inside this you can just replace these folders right so what i will do there I will just copy uh, some of them. Uh, mostly, we don't need any DPI. Otherwise, you can just all uh, uh, mapped folder. You can just copy from there and replace in this, and just delete these uh, older icons and paste it there. New one, right? After that, if we'll check, uh, these are the newly or the older one. Here you can see that this is the new icon that we just uh, generated right after that you don't need to just put any path and all just uh, create build again your application with the npx react hyphen native run hyphen android and that's it after that you will find currently you can see that 
we have the older icon with the first project after that you will find this icon is actually replaced with the newly which is a uh, golden and uh, black icon this one all right so let's wait for a moment so application build is uh, successfully done so now you can see that if we just go back there uh, icon of first project has been changed so this is the way that how we can change uh, the icon of our application and in next part we will learn that how we can change icon for uh, ios application this is about the android android part right so that's all for this part if you still have any query question you can ask in the comment box thank you guys thank you so much for watching this video